welcome to a wet, rainy day at Lloyd Water Valley. Matthew, happy National Roller Coaster today, son. Good? Yeah, no feeling good. Yeah. It's been rough, man. It's Scotty D. Oh, How yeah. you feeling, Scotty D? Bag. <laughs> yeah, so uh, first time we've ever been to this park. So it'll be interesting to see what it's like. It's got home to the Europe's longest roller coaster called the Ultimate, and I've heard a lot, a lot about that. Built by British Rail, so uh, hopefully it'll be a nice uh, train ride. I think. How big your anticipations? I think he's going to be right there. <laughs> Matt, anticipations for this? Still feel sick. Leave me alone. Yeah, he, look at his <laughs> shoes. Vomed on his shoes in a car. Hey, Too much beer and chips. Right. Oh my god. Q jumping. Here we go. Q line POV. Let's have it. I've heard the front's meant to be brutal, but the back's meant to be insane, so I'm either. Back seat, yeah. Hold on. Oh god, chuck this over. Oh, babe. This has to be the most difficult <laughs> belt. <laughs> let it go, let Hold on. it go. Here we go. I'll get it. I think, no? I don't know. I'll get it. Just about. No. Yeah, please. <laughs> ah, okay. okay. Thank you. Here we go. First reactions on the ultimate. Praying for my life. Is this <laughs> Of course it does. I didn't even think about that. Oh Jesus! Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> That's for the frown. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that road. Stage two. Stage two. Ah, stage two. Yeah. Right, draw you off before we go. Oh God! Oh no! Oh. What the hell? Oh my God! Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. The second half is something else. Jesus Christ. That was good. That was. I enjoyed that. Two years to get there. <laughs> right, I'll see you in a bit. I think we had some uh, very mixed reactions uh, from Matthew and Scott. What do you reckon, Matt? Didn't like that. How come? I've got internal bleeding. My kidneys are coming out my ears. Well, you had a good ride. Good ride. Did you like that ride? Yeah, yeah. man, it was good. Do you like it? Ah, yeah. At the front. Yeah. Yeah. Down at the front. Is it front? Down at the back. Ah, yeah. The back. It's terrible. Yeah. Really much more. Try the back. We love the back seat, trust me, man. See you again, mate. 
Cheers, Cheers, man. There we go, verdict uh, from gentlemen there. Royce, uh, I liked it. I think it was a good coaster. It's not something you'd get, you know, very often. I mean, it's the only coaster built by British Rail, so that's something. I don't know. I don't know what I'd rate it. I want to get a. I might three. get a. Give it another ride towards the back. Cause give one. One. I'd, gi I'd give it a three because it worked and didn't break down. At least I won a game of noughts and crosses with Matt. An initial ride, I'd probably give it a six to seven. I think. Yeah, it's all right. Honestly, the first bit, you had some nice pops of air time, yeah. The second bit was just wild. Like, it was a bit rough, yeah, I gotta lie. But um, it took some of the corners at like, speeds I'd never even think was possible. Yeah, yeah but Chris, <laughs> it, was, it was that boring that me and your wife over there actually resorted to board games. Yeah, it takes... <laughs> played noughts and crosses. <laughs> It takes uh, <laughs> it takes a few minutes to get up them lift hills. To be fair, but just enjoy the views, you know. It's Yorkshire, it's we lovely. Had a game of chess. Nothing green. We had a game of noughts and crosses. What did okay. you think? I'm of pretty it? sure we could have got out to play tag. I feel like it was a nice relaxing time up the lift hill because I just chilled and played chess. What did you think of the bit when you actually went down the drop? And I just random. want to know where them two men came from and where he got there. Oh, yeah, there's two men. I That's feel random. Like we've been on the ride that long. They were building a new ride. Yeah, if, <laughs> I'll, I'll put it here if you, if you didn't see it. Yeah, so here we are, Rapture Attack. I've heard some good things about this too. Uh, indoor coaster. Apparently it's very dark. So uh, let's see what this is like. Here we go. Oh my god. <laughs> Did he actually eat his head then? Eh, uh, mind your head. Oh my god. Is he serious? If there's a spider in your sweat. Oh mind. man, this is, this is dark. Oh, okay. You stand up. Oh, there you go. It's like just going walking down the canal in it by Tickton. <laughs> Down the cut. Down the cut. That's alright, this is. What a lovely bow you have, Chris. It'd be nice to see, obviously they wouldn't do, but like if you call to see something like the Black Country Museum, they've got a mine where you can go in. It'd be good to have like a little ride section in there. That'd be really cool. That's creepy, man. Here we go. <laughs> For you, you <yeah. laughs> Right, I'm gonna put you on me uh, chest in a sec and uh, we'll go for a ride. Probably can't see much at all, but at least you'll hear whether it's good or not from our voice in pain or in joy. So, here we go. There is, you gotta run. <laughs> Like that one in black roll. Oh, okay. Oh. That's a big lap bar. Thank you. Good luck seeing anything on this one. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Oh dear. Look at, the, look at this. This looks mad. Oh man. I cannot see a thing. Oh my god. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs>
Hello. That was all right, huh? Oh. I've only got a bit of a leak. Oh. I honestly thought something was coming after me then. Yeah, good, 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 yeah, snow. Oh, sand, oh. Sand. Yeah. Better than ultimate. Oh, yeah, yeah. Matt? Much better. I love Great. Great. Good ultimate. Yeah. That was disappointing. What? I thought it was good. I, I, I do prefer Ultimate, but I think it's just more that sentimental value because it's so like really unique and I don't think we'll ever get a coaster like Ultimate again. But Rapture Attack is Rapture. a pretty solid Rapture. solid indoor coaster. I kind of like, uh, kind of expected like Walking Dead the ride, but honestly it's, it's quite smooth actually. I thought anyway, on the front it was, it was nice and smooth. Um, it wasn't... It wasn't very intense. I mean, it's, it's pretty much, it's very much a family coaster. Um, I did, I did enjoy it. And there's not some surprises, some dinosaurs popping out. Uh, I thought it was, you know, really quite well done. I'd probably uh, I'd say it's about a six out of 10, uh, but it's a good six out of 10, that one. Um, right, I don't know where we're going now. I think that's closed. We'll find out. There's goggles on a big, on a big apple. So that's pretty cool. Pirate ship, nope. Black Pearl, if you can see it over there. Definite nope from me. I'm feeling a bit rough today. Uh, so anything that swings is definitely going to set me off. Um, I might. If not, I'll just give my camera to them lot and they can film it. But I'll see how I feel. <sighs> I don't do well with pirate ships. I really don't. Here we go. So, Hungry Harbour. Nice. Actually, it's quite reasonable. Jack and potato. Three pound ninety five. Chicken Philip burger four fifty. How much is it in Oakwood? Yeah. Nine quid or something. It's nice though. Seven quid. About seven or eight quid. It's nice at Oakwood. That's, that's, oh, is it children's? Well, it, it's there if you want it. <laughs> Do I have to be a child to order the children's menu? Is this, is this like a law now? I don't know. No. <laughs> I ain't got a clue. Right. Where, where's like, where's adults menu then? There you go. Where is it? There you go. Oh, Seven twenty-five. Ah, That's how much so it was in Oakwood about. I think. It's. I don't know if it's the same thing. I don't know. Yeah. Reasonable prices. How was your chicken fillet, Matthew? Very chicken. Very chicken, chicken, chicken and fillet. Any? Be, what's better, Oakwood or like Water Valley's chicken? Food. Oh, Oakwood. Oakwood. Yeah. yeah. See, I didn't have anything off or, you know what, I'm there. I still feel a bit rough. And if, if we're going to end up going on anything that remotely spins or swings, I'm going to be like Matthew this morning. I don't want to call him Matthew today, it's his name. Man. It's not, well, it is my name, but I hate it. <laughs> the saw right over there. See those dinghy slides? Oh my God. I look really good. See, that's a guilty pleasure of mine. I like, uh, when was it, Oakwood? I really enjoyed the slides there. That really good. They look even better. That drop looks insane. Right, we'll uh, we'll be checking them out definitely. Get a get a bit moist. Oh, I shouldn't say that really. What are you looking at? Look at that man. That drop is sick. You ready for this? Yes. Yeah, me and Matty and Oakwood, we was like on the slides about 50 times, man. So good. And uh, a tip to these: if you double up, it gets a lot faster. So. Uh, if you do go on these, don't go by yourself, do do it double because it's better. Mate, people say it's all about the ultimate, but no. It's about these slides for me today. All of them. So looks like you've got slide one here, which is a steep drop. Slide two, got a bit of air time on that. And um, slide three, around the corner. Got some uh, nice helixes, so let's get it, let's get it on. Okay. Oh dear. Slide one, and I'm nervous. Oh God! Oh my bloody hell, son! Oh! I love the distance you get, man. That's sick. <laughs> oh dear! Oh my God! Oh! Holy cow! <laughs> Nearly hit the wall. <laughs> okay, slow free. Here we go. Oh, oh dear! Hey! Oh, shit! Oh, Jesus! 
think of these corners, not. Oh my god! Oh dear. Whoa! Fucking hell! <laughs> <laughs> See you in a bit. <laughs> You're on the telly now. What was the slides called? Uh, splash. I don't know. I don't know. Splash Falls or something like that. Toilets. What's your favourite? Uh, the indoor one. The, the indoor the, one. The, the, that one. Slide one. Slide on the left. Slide on the left. I think it's slide one. And uh, my favourite person. It was a toss up between slide one and slide three. Because the, the third one, it's quite intense for like one of those kind of water slides. It literally really steep drop, loads of speed, and at the bottom, like you feel like you're gonna like fall under your back. It's quite a lot of force on that. Scotty, dear, what was your favourite slide, mate? Oh, what was your favourite slide? <laughs> There's a wasp right behind you, bro. I just matched ginger beer. Um, this one here, the end one. That one. Oh, yeah, it's a good man. Five, eight, four, break the go! Break the go! Oh, okay. <laughs> no, exactly. Oh. <laughs> the cow is one tip back. <laughs> it's a very small horse. Oh, oh. Why does that always happen? It does actually when you're filming. <laughs> I actually thought it was like a giant guinea pig at first. <laughs> and I realised. Oh. When I was a young warthog. Oh, guys. Oh, will be. Oh. Do you not sit asleep? I've got to put up with every night. Night. Yeah. Stop being back at Alton Towers again. <laughs> Stop mocking the chickens. Look, them, them, them moving now. So we'll bang your heads up, watch. Hey, 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 Keep. Um, that one with her ass out there. <laughs> <laughs> well. Matt. Matt. You put a tool. <laughs> Stop. Stranger oh, danger. Oh, look, the boys are up. Hey. Let's have a nice. <laughs> Gentle ride on the chair swingers. This one looks pretty quick though, to be fair. Welcome at NASA. Matthew. Hello. Holding on to my ring. I'm a married man now. Right. Ah, oh, nice and gentle. Here we go. Fountains. Oh, it's actually, it's wet. It's rain. Wow, this is quick. Good God. This is intense. What? What on earth, man? Holy cow! Oh, wow! Oh, wow! This, this is pretty awesome, man. Quite intense, this, isn't it? Oh, man! Very intense. It's not when it, when it dips down, man. You can feel, feel. Oh god! Feel all the G force. You can definitely feel it. Yeah. I'm about to put. 
all in about three G's, you know. That was that was a really good chair swing at that. Definitely one of the best ones I've done in terms of intensity. But also have some fountains. Fountains? Yeah, like right monkey in. swinger. Right yeah, on our boat. You can, you can, you can pretend. <laughs> awesome ride. Right, that's good, like 8.79 out of 10. You reckon? All we need For a chair swing, yeah. All we it. need was fountains. Right, right, that's what it is. All we need was fountains. And the name change the park, Fantasia, and it just be done, done, done. No, that's nice. I was really surprised how intense that actually was. Yeah, it's 1.2. Yeah, <laughs> Wonder what's, is there a 1.5 meter ride? Yeah. Because why would they have that there? Comment below, we'd love to know. Eagles Creek Farm then? It is. We was looking for Trauma Tower and I didn't realise it was a little uh, junior drop tower. I thought it was like a horror kind of ride, like a walkthrough, ghost, ghost train or something like that. Um, but we ended up here instead. So let's check it out. And if you see over there, there's Eagles Claw, which is, uh, I think it's a KMG. Uh, after Bernacon, I think. Uh, I don't know. It's, it's one nice. of those. It's one of those. Let's see some uh, plastic animals. Actually, these are real animals. Yeah. They might be real animals. Designated driver Matthew today. Where are we off to, Matt? Scoot, scoot. Scoot, scoot. Man, I'd love to go on that, but the way I'm feeling right now, I, uh, I don't know. It's not, it's not my kind of thing at the moment. <laughs> scoot, scoot! Scoot, scoot! Yes! He's going to the front! Right, who the hell has he got to the front? <laughs> he looks like a farmer! <laughs> oh no, I reckon they've tried to drive. Is that a real horse? No, it's a sheep. No, in the shed! <laughs> oh yeah! Is it real? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Excellent yeah. animatronics here from Lightwater Valley. Hello. Oh, it looks like you and have to be they got sound effects. See me rolling. Eighteen. Eighteen. Woo. Eighteen. I'm not touching it with a barge pole. But Evil Street Farm was good. Back again. I think we're going to cut the day a bit short today. It's uh, we've got a got another gig to get to yeah, tonight. Stuff to do, eh? stuff we are just, just and the, the, the weather's there. Uh, we have missed a few creds, but I'll be honest. Some what a save! Backseat, backseat. Ta da! I saw, I saw. This side. Oh, sorry. Backseat, yeah. Backseat. What are you filming now? I don't know. Here we go. Yes, boys. Bad day. Yo, eat. What the hell? Oh my god! This one, I feel like it's gonna be a man. Oh god. Oh mate. Oh my god! Oh, what? what the hell? Oh, oh. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Jesus Christ, mate! This is lethal! Oh <laughs> Jesus! Oh the pain! Oh, <laughs> 
You can tell the British Rail has never made a roller coaster before until now. Freaking oh. hell. They yeah, built it now, I'm back. Hey, they designed that. Ah. Kids' children, look. Man, that, that was lethal. <laughs> Good fun though. So the ultimate is something else. <laughs> is probably one of the roughest ride experiences of my life. I mean, you could feel every like banking on that. And some of the transitions are not brutal. As you can see from the POV, I was being swung from nearly my seat to Scott and outside the train and all sorts. But I tell you what, the air time and the speed and how fast it takes in them corners. Oh, it's insane. But um, I think we're just going to get a rapture attack and then call it a day now, sadly. But that was an insane ride. Boy, I really like rapture attack. I think it's a good, one of the best dark rides in the country, though. Well, dark indoor coasters. Um, I actually think it's better than Walking Dead, the ride. What do you reckon, Scott? Huh? Do you reckon that or Walking Dead? Walking Dead. How come? Just... I just felt like that overall was executed better. Like I loved all the bit where you're going into the mines. Kind of feels like you're going on a bit of a journey and the theming's really good too. And uh, the coast is dead smooth. Uh, it's got some nice drops on there and a nice, like, some nice forces towards the end as well. And some nice forces on the brakes because, yeah, prepare yourself for that. And uh, coming down, there's some, some, some surprises as well, even in the exit. It's good. Um, solid, solid. Six and a half, seven out of ten, that. Yeah, good one. So I think we're calling it a day now. Obviously, there's a lot more at like Water Valley. It's just came for a nice short day. Managed to get on the ultimate because it's been on my list to do for a very long time. Um, and I'm, I'm glad I've done it. It's a great coaster. It's a very interesting one and very unique. Uh, ride experience wise it's it kind of reminds me of a big one like obviously without the drop but like it kind of got that feeling of the big one but in the trees and it's, it's like a lot more intense to be fair the the, the, the way it takes some of them corners you'll never get lateral g-forces like that on anything uh, but it's a nice nice little park kind of reminds me of like oakwood or something um yeah i'll, I'll definitely come back in the future um, I'll not not like a mad rush to get back, but if they did like, get a new ride, I'll definitely definitely be coming back. Um, ride of the day, well, day of the ride day is of the ride. day of the. I said that in a while. Day of the ride is the ultimate. Matt, Raptor attack or whatever it was called. Yeah. Right, day of the ride. The ultimate. The ultimate. So. Raptor attack and Scott, day of the ride. Scotty boy, day of the ride. Um. This is a tricky one, he's thinking about this. Is it Emo Creek Farm? S slide three. Slide three. Slide three. Ride of the day for Scott. That was a good one. Anyway, oh, swing. Was that? The oh, the, ch the chair swing, yeah, no, that was that's, really surprising. That one. Was that? Um, just the park swing. The park swing. Oh, the swing in the it's it's park. What oh, swing set? I bowed down. Yeah. And the, the cows, the cows are good as well. But, um, yeah, like I said, come down. Re I, I do recommend it. Obviously, if you're traveling a long, long way, um, I wouldn't make it a two day park. Just it, it'll let you know if we get a rainy day, get back down to. Yeah, like I'd come for a down. single day and then ch like check out some of the stuff in the area as well. It'd be nice to spend like a couple of days around there. Uh, Yorkshire, see? Yeah, Yorkshire, Emmerdale. Anyways. Tay? Hi. No? Emmerdale, Central London. No, nah, that's Coronation Street. No, nah, East End is Yorkshire. What about Ollie Oaks? That's Australian. That's South Africa. If you enjoyed the video, then hit that like button, subscribe for more content like this, and give the bell a flick to keep all up to date.
Top left is the lightest video, bottom left is a video picked specifically for you, and the button on the right is the button to the right of your lives.